You know where you are. This is Nollywood Pictures TV. Problem. If there is anything now, you see it. Let's settle it. What happened? What is going on? Eh? Why are you hostile towards me? Honestly, you are acting as if we are contending for something. We are contending over a lot. Eh? We are contending over your domineering attitude towards everybody. Momo. Yes. What is even wrong with you? Eh? Why do you always hang shoulders? You feel like you're better than all of us. What do you have that we don't have? I am asking you what? Eh? Oh, you think you can deceive me? You think you can deceive us with this your nonsense basket making? It's not possible. You can't deceive me. Mm -mm. Nonsense. <sighs> what is bringing all this one? What, what, what is going on? What do I have that you don't... Look at my... Did I say you don't have front and back? Wait. Is it true? What she say? Is it true? How is it true? Do I hang my shoulders? Oh, can you like giving yourself problem? How is what she's saying through? See, Urema, count me out. I don't know what you're talking about. If there's any problem, say it. Obria. Urema, we are friends. I don't know where this animosity is coming from. If there's anything, my friend, let me know. Miko, don't, don't even try to come close to me. If you try it, if... This your height is even deceiving you. Don't even come close to me again. Maka ma kuki duka duka teta. Ma kuki blue black now. Non didi, didi. Oh push you go push me ba. Na ma kwami yo meleme o. Okay, who who ma pushed me? Yes. Who me organize? Eh, e push me again ni weme. Push me. Gini weme zia. Do you want me? Me here me come fu. E gu kwai. Ma kuga. Aka kwagi. Tu push me. Ogini. My latest royal bride. <laughs> You're welcome, my dear. Thank you, my Look queen. Look at you. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> my queen. Bring on the praises. Thank you so much. You're the best mother-in-law in the world. <laughs> oh, good one. Mm. In fact, you are the fairest of all the princesses that have treaded Mother Earth. Really? Yes. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Look at you. My beautiful future daughter-in-law. Hmm. <laughs> so how are you doing today? Ah, very well, my queen. Hmm, you look so classy, <laughs> ravishing, astonishing as ever. Ah, you're welcome, my dear. Thank so you. how are you doing today? Very well, my queen. Hmm. <laughs> how is your journey? Ah, very smooth. Thank ah. you. Come and sit. Come and sit. Ah. <laughs> Thank you so much, my oh, queen. I hope it's not stressful on you. Not at all, my queen. It was smooth. Okay. But 
A man from this kingdom tried to ruin my day. What? Who could that be? Mm -hmm. Just say the name and the culprit will face the punishment bitter than pain. <laughs> yes, I can. No, my queen, don't worry. Trust me. I handled the situation. Of course I do. <laughs> I do trust you. So how are your parents? Ah, enjoying royalty as usual. <laughs> I can't expect less than that. Sure. Call <laughs> Akuna <laughs> to get more glasses. Yeah. Uh, my queen. Yes. <laughs> I'd rather see the prince first. Mm -mm. <laughs> Wow, mm -hmm. I can imagine what my grandchildren will look like. Ah, mm -hmm. cute as ever. <laughs> okay, let me take you to him. Thank mm -hmm. you. I wish you know how much I miss you. Why is it so difficult for you to pick my calls or check on me? You seem not to miss me. Of course I do. Just my busy schedule, that's all. Busy indeed. You're too busy for your wife? Please don't patronize me with those silly excuses. I am not a fool. Neither have I called you one. My apology. I hope no woman is trying to take your attention away from me. Because I will not hesitate to kill her. Father. Son. You're welcome to my palace. How are you? Very well, Your Highness. What of your daddy, the king? My very good friend. Very well. <sighs> I can see my son is already taking care of you. Your husband to be. <laughs> Let me leave both of you to observe some privacy for intending couples. Thank you. You're welcome. Son. That was very rude. How can you sit and greet my father, the king? <laughs> Are you serious? Do you expect me to roll on the ground just because of a mere pleasantry from your father? You know me better than that. That pretense is not my kind. I will not play the holier than thou character just to please my father or my mother-in-law. Besides, my father is a king, and he's a king to the kingdom, but he's my father, and I don't roll on the ground when I want to greet him. Impressive. Very well, then. Make yourself comfortable. I'll join you later. Excuse me. Remember. Don't keep me waiting. I'm glad you observe it yourself. Each of the words and attitude spells pride and arrogance. Is that the kind of woman you want me to get married to? As a wife father? One who visibly lack home training? That's it? I understand your point, son. But you see, there is absolutely nothing anybody can do about it. She is betrothed to you from childhood and automatically that makes her your wife. I know if you work on her, she will definitely change to a new shape. 
I know you to be a vibrant young man with that is cultured and a good mindset, an optimistic mindset. I trust you, son. I trust you. Father, it is not easy to change an adult, especially one with so much pride and arrogance, like Princess Adugo. Hmm. Like I said, she will change. Okay? Well, I'm going to talk to the father, the king, about that. At least she will change to a better person. But for now, let's change this topic, son. Let's change it. How are you preparing for the forthcoming birthday celebration? Son? Talk to me, son. Father. Mother. Yes. Since the date of my wedding and traditional marriage almost clashed with my birthday, I'm thinking to myself that there shouldn't be an elaborated birthday. Since there is already a big feast around the corner. Secondly, I would like to bring to your attention that I would prefer a few friends in attendance for my birthday. Hmm, that's a nice decision. Yes. You see? <laughs> I've always known that my son is not ostensible. Well, since both of you have reached a consensus, son, put up a bill and I will mobilize you accordingly. Hmm. I have made more than enough money that can take care of my family, even to the next generation. Hmm. <laughs> Come to talk about you, my son, I can go extra mile. <laughs> I can do anything to make my prince happy. Thank you so much, Father. You're welcome. I'm so, so happy for you, son. Thank you, mother. I'm happy. Yes. <laughs> I'm Thank happy. Thank you so much, mother. I'm so happy. your highness. Yes. Oh, don't worry. Don't worry. Yeah, we can do it ourselves. Okay, your mm highness. -hmm. Right. Sure, this will be right. food and tea, fine. Mm -hmm. Sorry. <laughs> when are you going to quit with your pranks? Whenever you quit enlightening me with the angelic jiggles. <laughs> How are you today? I'm fine, thank you. And you? Yeah, I'm doing pretty well. <laughs> How about your parents? They went out. They went to my maternal home. They'll be back in the evening. Oh, good. So I can see that you are alone. Yes, I'm alone. Same here. The palace is so bored. So I thought wise to... Come out so we can go on our usual walk. And also remind you about the upcoming birthday celebration. My prince, you don't have to remind me. How can I forget the birthday of a very special one? <laughs> <laughs> you know what, let me just finish up with the basket so we can go. Okay, okay uh, let, let me just help you then. No, my prince. What will people say if they see you making a basket? Please. What will people say? 
Oh, my and take a look at this. Royalty looks good on you. And remember, we are one. Whatever you do is what I do. I've learned the craft from you, right? My prince, you're a kind man. So special. You know my angelic love. <laughs> come on, come on, let's go. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, so it's gonna be much faster. My proven, right? You learned. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> so you're gonna be a good lad. Yeah. Okay. So there you go. Mm -hmm. So we gotta be here until the director says it's cut. He's cut. What is that? He's cut. Who is talking? <laughs> My love, why the sudden change of mood? That is because I am pained. My prince. Do you realize how it hurts to know that you can never be mine? How it hurts to know that this fire of passion that burns in our heart will end sooner or later. Even when even while you're in my arms, it hurts to know that we can never be together. It hurts to know that you belong to another person. My prince, it hurts to live in this illusion we we'll call love. My love. What we have is not an illusion. It's true. It's pure. I understand how you feel. And I wish I can do something about it. To always wipe your tears when you cry. To always have a shoulder you can lean on when you're heartbroken and downcast. But if wishes are horses, faith is often a parcel. God knows we are in this together. Greetings, Mrs. Sakuna. Ah, Ujumwa. How are you? I'm doing fine, ma. What is it? The prince sent for you. Oh, my prince. <laughs> Tell him I'll be with him shortly. Eh? Okay, ma. Greetings, the kindest prince of our time. A man whose humility has encouraged the entire youths of our kingdom. God is always with you. Greetings, Mrs. Akona. 
you would not see is an amazing man with your praises and sense of humor, most especially your wisdom. I'm honored, my prince. It is always a pleasure to be at your service. <laughs> As well honored. Please do have a seat. Thank you, my prince. <sighs> my prince, you are smiling, but that does not hide the fact that you are troubled. And that is why you sit here alone and sent for me. You're right, Mrs. Akona. You're very correct. My prince, your restless nerves testifies that the still water of love is troubled. Indeed, it is. I went to see her today. And she said a lot of things. And they were all facts. Disturbing facts. She reminded me of the fact that we can never be together. She reminded me of the fact that I am for another woman. She reminded me of the fact that we may dwell in perpetual emotional torture when we shall have finally parted. She also said that we are living in an illusion. I felt guilty. I couldn't defend myself. She was right about all what she said. Now I'm telling myself that we should quit instead of continuing our journey of no destination. No, my prince. You don't have to say that. Every journey of beautiful destination, every journey of rosy end, always comes with obstacles. And those obstacles are designed by the evil forces to make you quit. But only the wise sees beyond today and continue trading. My prince, you are not a coward. Neither is she. She is only a woman. And sometimes we are too weak to fight. And that is why we have a hero to keep us moving. The men in our lives. Amaka needs you now more than ever. She needs your courage. Please do not give up. The gods are with you. This is Akona. My prince. Thank you for your words of wisdom. You're always my strength whenever I'm weak. <laughs> my prince, it's not you know. You don't have to thank me. In fact, I should be the one thanking you for giving me a privilege to share in your problems. Yes, um, let me get your special coffee. It will help calm your nerves. Uh -huh. Do not forget to call her tonight. And tell her that you are a soldier, not a chicken, to give up. Oh? Let me get your coffee. I'll be with you. Ibo! Udogo ikaleka. Udogo nyumunya. Ogwe lo mage june jaga no guo. Momo gide jawane igwen. Inanuno no bolidan. Imana gwana bode na nanyama ronke buoke. Oh, must live a match in me. 
Oguaja in Kembo no Munya Kingdom. You are indeed skilled in fluting. You won't cease to amaze me. Oh my king. You have made my day. I am glad you are entertained. I'm happy. Um let us go ahead to the business of the day. Actually, I invited the three of you because of my son's uh, upcoming birthday and uh, traditional marriage celebrations. They are coming simultaneously. <laughs> they are in close dates. And uh, as a matter of fact, I'll be expecting lots and lots of visitors. A lot of personalities will be in attendance. At least, we have to prove to the entire world that Omunya Kingdom has the best pan wine tapper and the best flutes that the world can provide. <laughs> Your Majesty, count on me. I'll yeah. deliver. <laughs> Okoro, my man. Your Majesty. Your assignment is not far-fetched. You shall provide all the cows and all the livestock that will be needed for that occasion. Like I said, my friends in diaspora will be in attendance. Please, I believe I won't be disappointed. I'm at your service, Your Majesty. Yeah. <laughs> your Majesty, as you are oh no, consider all these things done. <laughs> Don't expect less from you. <laughs> oh no, Igwe. Oh no, Igwe. Oh no, Igwe. Oh no. Igwe Kareka. <laughs> I am happy. Oh, <laughs> Papa. <laughs> Good, good. Hey, Ure, Ure, hmm? help me go through this later. Hmm? Check if he's romantic enough for my other sonny. <laughs> You know, I'm as well, Anna. Okay. Sonny, my hero. <laughs> my hero, I hope the angels are watching over you. I just want to check on you since you have refused keeping a date with me. After my several requests, how is business and life generally? I hope God is with you, my love. I want you to know that I'm praying for you every day. I'm praying for our future. Mm. All I ask is that you give me a chance to be the rainbow and the sunshine in your rain, the fragrance on your beautiful skin, and queen of your heart. <laughs> I wish to see you soon, and I and I want to know when it will be possible. Take care, my charming prince. <laughs> Yours forever, and Didi Amaka. <sighs> Love one thing, say. Anyway, <laughs> you try, Sha. But the truth is that, eh? Do you know you're wasting your talent? Hmm? Mm. If you apply these skills in writing love novels, eh? Who is Shima Amanda Chindi? She won't even see your back at all. Are you mm. trying to mock me, Uri? Eh? See, I, I don't want him to, to see that. I don't know anything. I'm an itibori boy. Money bit, you money bit now. But for this one, shall you try? No? <laughs> Honestly, I love Ogasoni too much. Too, too much. Mm. The only problem I'm having is Chamaka. Eh? That's the only problem. I, I don't know why she will not just, you know, focus on the prince and leave my Ogasoni alone. It's 
threatening me. But I know, I know that all these things she's doing, there's no way she will get away with it. I, Indy Damaka, will be the one to win over my August Tony. She will not win over me, oh. Eh? I feel that girl, she's using charm. If not, why would all these men be following her up and down like flies? Mm. She's not using any charm. You and I know she's very beautiful. See her height now. She has skills. We don't have any skill. We can't even patch our thumb dresses. We can't even make ordinary broom they used to sweep house. Mm -mm. And we're on Kai Pasta. We are useless, oh. Uh, yes, da. You are useless and not me. I am not useless. Oh? All I'm saying is that if she like, oh, let her have all the skills. That's her business. I don't care. She will never take over my sonny. Okay. Not why I am still alive. I will mm -hmm. not allow it. After all, she's not finer than I am. Mm -hmm. If she's finer than you are, that's your business. Mm -hmm. She's not finer than I am. And she does not have it all. I have all the accessories. Ne -ne -ne -ne. Okay. I have all of them. And I'm going to beat her to this game. Bam. And it will be titled Battle of Love. Before Uncle. So get ready for war. Action. Um, Uri, forget about that Amaka because before she will spoil what we want to do. Mm -hmm. Uh, I want you to help me deliver this letter to Ogasani. <laughs> As your errand girl or what? Hmm? You've practically turned me to your errand girl, Abby. I can't do it free anymore. In this country, eh, nothing is free. So you will need to pay for the career service, you understand? Are you not my friend? Mm -mm. Eh? Mm -mm. Uri, um, um, okay, see. You know that my skirt, the one that you've been begging me for, I'll give it to you. <laughs> Wait. You give me that, you're really scared. Uh -huh. That one I like so much. Of course. Are you serious? I'll give it to you. Just help me deliver it. Hey! Will you deliver it? Eh? It can address you. <laughs> See what you do. Uh -huh. Just close your eyes, eh? Close your eyes before you open it. Your me message has been delivered. <laughs> one touch, I will deliver the message. Now, now, now. Bring it to Package me, then. It. Package so it very well. It my oh, that's Sunny. Sunny is your soul. I don't want anybody to see it too. Mm -mm, nobody will see it. <laughs> then this one too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Before, <laughs> please give him as well. Okay. Well, let's go. Hey, but I don't want him to see me. He will not see you. Hide somewhere and wait for me. Yeah. Well, good. Let's go now. I don't want him to but as you can see, it's a very short one. Sure. Promise me you'll see me tomorrow. I will if I can get permission from my parents to go out. So you get permission from your parents? <laughs> you see, whenever you crave for something so desperately, you will get it like I crave for you. You must get it. Okay, fine. I'll see you tomorrow. Say promise. Cross your heart? I cross my heart. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. I'm gonna move you, okay? I miss you too. Take care of yourself. Bye. Uncle.